hundreds of people turned out at a meeting of the State Board of Land Commissioners in Casper in opposition of a proposed gravel pit on state lands. Our Julia Conti spoke with locals about their concerns. I'm here at the state office building in downtown Casper, where tensions were high at the State Board of Land Commissioners meeting. Hundreds of Casper locals were in attendance to show their opposition of the proposal of a controversial gravel pit. The State Board of Land Commissioners moved their meeting from Cheyenne to Casper in order to accommodate the hundreds of citizens who wanted to be in attendance. Bruce Coates, whose family Coates Road is named after, tells us why he's here today. Basically, I'm here to try to protect my water rights. This poses a big threat to us. Bruce mentioned that earlier in the week, he and some other ranchers took Governor Mark Gordon and Wyoming State Auditor for a tour of the possible gravel pit site. They're very, very aware of it. Um, they even see the, the, how delicate it is. The discussion of the proposed mining operation didn't begin until well after the meeting was set to end. Members of the Casper Preservation Alliance stated that they took the day off work to attend. The crowd grew impatient as the gravel pit discussion was continually pushed further down the agenda. Bruce speculated the delay was purposeful. Well, they keep moving the schedule and they just keep rearranging it and all. I don't think it's fair. I, just, I, I don't know if they're pushing this back because of the, so many people here that have to go back to work. The State Board of Land Commissioners considered denying public comment. Secretary of State Chuck Gray referred to the consideration as unconscionable and even suggested it was an attempt to run out the clock. I definitely think that we should have sand and gravel first. I think that's the way it was noticed, and I think that's the understanding. Very confused this notion that we're going to build a time with an understanding there's a 1 p.m. stop. It's almost like trying to cut off public comment. According to the Casper Mountain Preservation Alliance members, the State Board of Land Commissioners remains in the hot seat for last year's approval of leases that would allow Prism Logistics, LLC, to begin their mining operation. The Casper Mountain Preservation Alliance organizes frequent meetings to discuss the gravel pit. Julia Conti, Your Wyoming Link, Casper.